Hey guys, what is up? I am back again with another video. And you see I have my sister here. Hey. I'm Kendry. I'm Kaylee's older sister. Today we are going to be doing a mukbang. As you can see, we have food right here. We went to Applebee's and got our favorite. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Yeah, you can never go wrong with Applebee's because they always got the deals. Two for 20, three appetizers for $13.99. And so for our appetizers, we got the chicken wonton tacos. The best appetizer besides best spinach, spinach and artichoke dip. dip. It comes with coleslaw, chicken, and like some type of sauce that they put on it. And it is absolutely so good. This is what it looks like. So with that being said... We're gonna go ahead and jump into the video because I am hungry. hungry. Real hungry. You guys, what are you guys doing? We can't walk. All right, so there's nine tacos and there's two of us. Two divided by nine does not Girl, equal. nine divided by two. <laughs> um, <laughs> so we're obviously gonna have to split a taco. No, I'm gonna eat the taco. We're gonna split it evenly in half. So we each get four and one half of a fifth. Half of a fifth? Girl. So. Okay, story time. Whoa. Hi. Okay, story time. So we're living in Alaska. And At that time, our dad was in the army. We were living in a three-story house. And so, we were at the bottom floor, and we didn't know that our dad was grilling all the way at the top. So, we are being little kids, not even knowing what we were doing. We knew what we were doing, but you get the gist. So, we were throwing rocks. No. He specifically told us, do not touch the rocks. What did we do? Touch, Touch the, the rocks. rocks. <laughs> so we literally, we didn't, uh, mind you, we didn't know he was upstairs on the, on the first, the first one? The top. Oh, the top floor grilling. We didn't hear him and smell no barbecue, no nothing. We got the rocks and we was literally throwing them at the neighbor's house. Like they, they killed our dog or something. Like they didn't do nothing to us. We were just throwing the rocks at their house. And that lasted for about like 20 minutes. 10, 15, 20 minutes. No, it was more like 10. And we heard a noise like coming from upstairs. So we look up and we see him and we're like, we just froze. So me, Kaylee, and our little sister, Karina. We, we knew it was, but we went to the room and we put on five pairs of shorts. Five pairs of shorts, hid underneath the bed. We the all closet. hid underneath the bed. I was trying to be the last one by the wall so I wouldn't get pulled out first. <laughs> And you know what happened? Kaylee get dragged out first with her foot. Literally, I never got a biggest whoop butt whooping in my life. Bro, it's so funny looking back at it now. But in the moment, mm -mm. well, yeah, it's funnier thinking back. That's it, what it, it doesn't sound that funny right now, but it was hilarious thinking back at it. Um, one time I was in class in sixth grade. I went to Barrington Middle School, and I had Miss Albright for English reading and you know how you guys gotta take turns reading a little section of the book for reading out loud yeah for reading out loud or whatever i was reading a section and i like am really slow like really slow if you can't tell like i'm like she has these really kaylee slow. moments is what we yeah. call them and, and at that time she had a kaylee moment yeah so i was reading you know i was trying to go fast or whatever because i didn't want to sound like i was stuttering i was trying to go real fast and i said Nigeria, when it said Nigeria, Who I was so embarrassed. And I was like the only black person in my class, and I like just humiliated myself. I was like, oh my god. Okay, so when we lived in Alaska, another story time when we lived in Alaska, our parents they always left for work before we went to school because we would walk to school. It was like literally two seconds away from our house. So after um, we got out of school, we were walking home thinking nobody was going to be home because we wore these skirts to school that we weren't allowed to wear. We wasn't allowed to wear the skirts without leggings underneath or if we didn't ask. 
So me and Kaylee just walking home and we saw our friends on the way home. We're yeah. like, hey, no, bro, we was like, we finna look cute today with that little mini skirt. We went, we had no leggings, nice. no leggings. <laughs> we thought we were so cute. Anyway, so we were walking home thinking every, like everything was gonna be all good. Nobody was gonna be home. Mom we and dad got home. work. We're about to get home, take these skirts off, hang them back up like we never wore them. <laughs> so we're walking home. We look in the driveway and we see a car and we're like. We didn't bring no extra change of clothes, no nothing with yeah, us. Yeah, we that that yeah, we used to do that. We used to always bring an extra change of clothes and we didn't that day. When we weren't supposed to wear what we were when we, when we didn't ask to wear yes. something. We always brought an extra change of clothes. That day we didn't bring an extra change of clothes. And it happened to be our little sister's birthday. We saw our mom and she basically cussed us out. We got a butt whooping. We was on restriction. Hey, restriction at that time, they took away our DSIs. <laughs> <laughs> they, they took Bruh. away. What else did they take away? Our journals. <laughs> <laughs> we used to write in these little journals, bro. We couldn't play school. Then we used to, bro. Bro, we will always play school. I was a teacher. You know the those big bins that you put clothes in, like the blue ones we have in the garage? That would be the desk, bro. And we used to sit on pillows. <laughs> I thought we were at school. And we had electives, cooking class and all. <laughs> but we was we used to always play um make pigs in a blanket. Like you know the little hot dogs. And, and the, the little the soft bread, pretzels. Right? Frozen soft pretzels. We couldn't use the easy bake oven. But we did anyway. The easy bake oven. <clears throat> We was in Girl Scouts at the time, too. Oh, yeah. We couldn't go to um, one of the events. I think that was one of our punishments. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, we also used to wasn't be able to take our phone to school. <laughs> I was in middle school. Bruh. In middle school, we weren't allowed to take our phones. No, elementary, no. Elementary, middle school. I was in middle school. Kaylee was in elementary school. Our mom had I was school. in middle school, too. At Barrington, I wasn't allowed to take her phone. Oh, when I was in the eighth grade and you were in sixth grade. Bro, I used to always wear mascara, bro. So we also weren't allowed to um, bring our phones to school during like elementary and middle school because like my mom thought we were gonna be on it during class, we were gonna lose it, somebody's gonna take it, blah blah blah. So like we said, our mom leaves before us and we get home before her. So we try to be slick and stuff, bringing our phones to school. One day, she got home before us. And, and she was looking for our phone. I left my case there. And I left my case there, but I plugged the charger into the case to make it look like the phone was still there. <laughs> and I still got caught. Bruh. Okay, so it was a school night. Me. <laughs> Bruh. Me, Kaylee, Karina, we were on Kaylee's room just painting each other's nails, toes. Just playing music, like just having a good time. Was vibing, vibing. On school night. <laughs> My mom walks in and says, "What the? Are you guys doing? It's a school night." We had no privileges. We were so bad when we were little. We she weren't was, allowed to sleep in each other's room at night on school nights because she knew that we would be up all night talking to each other or doing something that we weren't supposed to do. It got to the point where we all used to sleep outside of our doors. Like we used to all have our head outside our doors. <laughs> Okay, so anyways, so she walks in, it's like 1.30 in the morning, and she was like, clean all this up, and everybody go in their own bed. No phones tomorrow. No phones whatsoever. So tomorrow, the next day comes, and we have school, mind you, again. She no. thought it was a dream. Yeah, it was a dream. Why? What do you mean, why? We took all our nail polish off. Oh. <laughs> but this, let me tell you what happened. We all went back into our own rooms. We no, 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 no. We, we cleaned up Kaylee's room because we were in Kaylee's room. We cleaned up Kaylee's room. We sprayed so it didn't sound we like... We sprayed you know? so much Lysol. Took off our nail polish that we painted. I took it off Karina. So my mom did we not threw away anything. the cotton balls. <laughs> we, we, threw flushed away the, we flushed the cotton balls down the toilet. We was like, we finna have our phones tomorrow, baby. <laughs> who, who not finna have So, phones? come tomorrow, she Let's forgot day. all about it. I think, we honestly think that she thought it was a dream. Yeah. Because we had our phones. We told her about this, like, a few months ago. But, yeah. We faced our mom to believe that it was a dream. We all took our nails off, blah, 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 cleaned the room. 
Who had their phone the next day? Us. So we're on the last box. box. There's three left. You guys also loan me this brush and then GX is a huge type the brush. Mm. I'm I was the gang, I was the mob, what was you thinking? Remember them days and that shit was hard, a nigga been thinking. We finished the wonton tacos. And they were so good. Zealish. What is wrong with you? I'm gonna eat these alive. Give it to me. It is not even hard. When my mom was pregnant with me, all she ate was lemons, and I grew up eating lemons like it's nothing. Watch this. So, how did Bentley? Bentley wants some food. Hey, hi. Look. So, if anybody is watching this that knows how to make intros, please comment down below. Because I've been trying and trying. I've been watching people's YouTube videos, how to make intros, this, that, 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 and the other. And I just really can't. Like, I literally spent two hours trying to make an intro today. And I just can't get it. So, if you know anyone... Who is willing to make an intro? Please leave it down in the description, not the description, the comments. Since New Year's just passed, let me let me tell you guys a funny story about New Year's. So when I was like ten, maybe, um, we lived in this house in Panther Trace, and you know how you eat black eyed peas on New Year's, whatever, blah blah blah. For good luck. Um, I had just ate some black eyed peas, and I went outside to ride my scooter. That she had just got for Christmas. That I had just got for Christmas. And I was like, rolling down the street in my six phone. And I literally fell, scraped everything. Blood. I thought I had a whole concussion. I was seeing Tweety Birds. And literally everybody was running down the street. They had to pick me up. I was bleeding, blah, 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 blah. I Crying. couldn't go to, yeah, I couldn't go to sleep for like hours because Everybody thought that I had a concussion. And ever since then, I do not like black eyed peas. That was like two, 2000, like 12 or 11. 11. That was like 2011. And to this day, 2019, I do not eat black eyed peas because I fell off my scooter after I ate black eyed peas. So I feel like they're not good luck. They're bad luck to me. So if you ever try to give me black eyed peas, I will give you a black eye. So guys, that is all we have for today. Sorry this video is really short because we were so hungry that we literally shoved everything down our throat. But that is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, everybody says that we look like Tia and Tamara, do we? Do we? If you think we do, please comment down below. If not, keep it moving because we are Tia and Tamara. <laughs> I'm kidding. Please do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. And we'll see you guys soon. Bye, Bye guys. I was fighting some demons, in the field bitch I'm deep in I was raised in the deep end, I know niggas be sinking